hello everyone how to solve this problem for the values of x if we have x plus 11 is equals to x and we solve this problem for all the values of x so here first we find all the roots of this equation and at the last we will check that which of the roots are solution and which of the roots are extraneous root of this equation so uh, further i can explain the term extraneous root uh, also uh, I can just solve this problem for two methods I hope so you like both of these methods but if you have any other method in your mind so please don't hesitate to write this method into the comment section so here in the first method our first target is to find the value of x if you see directly from here uh, you clearly see that we cannot find the value of x but here I can give you a nice technique in which you easily get the value of x so uh, sometime in exam uh your just question is that you find the value of x uh, so uh, this is a very uh, genius question or a very important question in how to find the value of x from here so uh, for this uh, we need to take the squaring on both of the sides of this equation so when we will take squaring it will be written as x plus 11 square is equals to x square and now further in the next step we need to use here the nice algebraic formula into the left hand side so that in the left hand side we use here this nice formula you know about that if we have a plus b whole square is equals to a square plus b square plus 2 times of a b so according to this formula we uh, just expand the left hand side of the above equation as in this form it will becomes x square plus 11 square plus 2 times of x into 11 is equal to x square and uh, now here in the next step we move this x square into the left hand side and it will be written as this is x square plus this uh, 11 square becomes 121 plus this is 2 times of 11 becomes 22x and this is positive x square when we move it into the left hand side it will become negative x square and this whole equation is equals to 0 and now you see here this is the negative term and positive term are cancelled out by each other and we get here 121 plus 22x and this whole equation is equals to 0. And now further uh, here our target is to find the value of x so that's why we move this 121 to the right hand side and it will be written as 22x is equals to minus 111 okay sorry 121 so uh, now uh, in order to find the value of x we need to divide both of the sides by 22 so when we divide it by 22 it will be written as this is 22 and 22 we divide on both of the sides and now further in the next step uh, you see here this 22 is cancelled out by this 22 and we will get here our x is equals to here we need to cancel uh, these terms to the table of 11 and we get here 11 2 is a 22 and 11 11 is a 121 so we will get here the value of x is equals to minus 11 over 2 so uh, this is uh, the final uh, root of the given equation which we get here from first method uh, and now here in the next steps we need to verify uh, this root and we will check that is this root is uh, satisfied our given question statement or not and in other words is this is the solution or this is the extraneous root for this we need to copy down given question statement here it is x plus 11 is equals to x and now here we put this value of x on both of the sides of this equation and we check the behavior of this equation so when you put this value here it will becomes minus 11 over 2 plus 11 is equals to this when you put this value here it will becomes minus 11 over 2 and now here uh, in the next step we need to take the LCM into the left hand side so when you take LCM it will becomes here uh, the LCM of this term is 2 so this 2 is cancelled out by this 2 and we will get here 
minus 11 plus this is 2 times of 11 becomes 22 is equal to minus 11 over 2 here we check that is both of the sides are equal or not and now you see here minus 11 plus 22 becomes 11 over 2 is equals to minus 11 over 2 so you see here both of the sides are not equal for the values of x is equals to minus 11 over 2 and so here we finally conclude about this value of x is that x is equals to minus 11 over 2 be the uh, extraneous root of the given equation okay it is not solution because it does not satisfy our given question statement and now here in the next step we again solve this problem for second method and in second method we need to copy down given question statement here so the given question statement is x plus 11 is equals to x so here uh, in second method i can just give the explanation into the state forward form uh, so here we just move uh, this x into the left hand side and we move this 11 to the right hand side and it will become this is positive x becomes minus x this is plus 11 becomes minus 11 and you see here this is negative and positive term are gone and we get here our 0 is equals to minus 11 so it is not possible case 0 is equals to 11 so uh, this is not possible uh, so we finally conclude that uh, in second method the given equation has not uh, no solution okay so we just write it here it has uh, no solution and this is the our final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos